I feel like a 5% radius isn't super impactful, especially how close together these towers are. 12 seconds later. I kind of wish I would have taken that range upgrade now. <laughs> Hello and welcome to another one shot. Uh, today we're trying out a demo for a game called TD Worlds. Uh, it looks like an indie uh, tower defense game. I'm a huge fan of, of tower defense games. I spent way more time than probably necessary in balloon tower defense four and five, but that's kind of on me. Um, this game is in demo. There will be a link to it in the Steam store below. Um, and just as a reminder, hey, if you want to see more one shots like this, please be sure to leave a like down below. Um, if you want to feel good about subscribe about small, if you want to feel good about supporting small YouTube, please hit the subscribe button, and we'll get started. We'll get started. So I did see a demo of this game, or I did see another video of this game played. Uh, also, I love how simple this art style is. I'll, I'll kind of give a synopsis of everything I like about it there towards the end of the end of the episode. I'm gonna try to play through the whole demo. I don't oh uh I don't know how much there is. Oh, I'm Chris. Uh oh shit. Um, I need to protect myself as soon as possible before they find me. Uh, good thing I know how to recycle shards of corruption into oh these. I just need to find a suitable place to build. Uh. Oh, okay, tower. Oh, um. Is it a click and drag or a... Oh, so I click it, it opens up, and then I decide where to place it. Okay, so there's really no reason for me to just not place... I assume one goes there. Um, a hundred. Uh, I like this spot right here. Not to be offensive or anything, but I don't want no stinking triangles getting to my crystal. Just me. Oh, I'm earning money. Hang on. Oh, so it's just standard tower defense. Cool. I love how simple this is. Simple color palette. Enemies are clearly defined. Uh, let's build another one here then. We're keeping the triangles away from our... Crystal? Ooh, what's that? What did I just pick up? Ooh. Wow, that's kind of bright. Okay, that's kind of hard to see there. Is that a reward? or? Oh, it looks like... I think this is a currency that we spend later on in the game. Oh, um... Dual... Area here? So let's stick something here, stick something here... And let's see, all right, they're coming from this side first, so we'll, oh, nope, they're coming from both sides first. Nice. So I am a, I have always been a sucker for the tower defense genre myself. Uh, I can just hit T as a shortcut, nice. I think I'm pretty well built up. Ooh, another currency. Oh, another currency. Another currency! Whatever that is. I really want to do more videos like this. I um, guess I'm buying another one of... Interesting. Yeah, what is? What's interesting? Is this just another single path? I'm guessing so. Let's kind of overload the front there. Ooh, they're gonna get through if I don't. There we go. Some more of whatever currency this is. I basically can build these things about as fast as I can make them. Look at all this extra currency. Eh, nailed it. 
So now what? Uh, I get to pick a tower? Oh, I can choose a reward. Um, so there's fire rate, which I'm guessing towers just attack faster, which I'm all for. More, I'm assuming firepower is just straight damage and radius uh, range. I feel like a 5% radius isn't super impactful, especially how close together these towers are. I'm going to go with the fire rate. Oh, now I can pick either a uh, one of these currencies or another tower upgrade. So far, I don't know what that current... Oh, dear God. Where are these coming from? Here first. I kind of wish I would have taken that range upgrade now. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh man, I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage. I also have a lot more currency to spend here. Alright, perfect. I don't like backloading my defense because it doesn't do like any damage to stuff over here. Oh, I'm probably going to start eating it here. Yeah, it takes a couple seconds for your defenses to react and... Oh, no! Oops. So, now what? I'm... I didn't mention that I've been... I've mentioned that I've been playing tower defenses for years. I never said I was good at it. Uh, Chris, how did it go there? According to the stats, the damage you received is incompatible with life. Ah, uh, yes. Translation, you dead. It is incredible that you're still... Shoot. Uh, we'll equip you for a new expedition, by the way. Check with the shop. Oh. Oh. Oh, so this is... So it's a... Oh, so this is also like a roguelike. You fail... You will fail, and as part of failing, you can go and build up currency to then try again and get further. Okay, so I need to definitely get more of that currency. So we go back at it again. So it's a tower defense. It's an indie game, which I love supporting small uh, indie developers. But it's also a roguelike and a tower defense game. I am a huge fan of roguelikes. Rogue lights. I'm not sure the difference. So we try this again here. Familiar places. Let's just front load a defense here. And again, I'm going to be prejudiced. I don't want these triangles anywhere near my crystal. To be fair, I'm a foreign invader incursion on their territory. Therefore... Their probably justified reaction, I can't stand. Oh, there's I lost my mouse there for a second. Still don't know what this currency's for. Actually, I might. I think there's an a shop, another shop, a, another another shop, that um, like an in between level shop where you can go buy upgrades. I think that's what this currency's for. I need to keep a closer eye on my. Uh, Ability to purchase goods or new tower more not new towers more towers and as I did mention this game is still in demo projectile speed ooh a minus two percent cost projectile speed so it flies faster we'll see how that works so this level again uh, throw there throw there Throw there, throw there. Oh, this is my upgrades, my projectile speed. I'm loving this game. I guess the little bit of uh, extra projectile speed, I don't necessarily notice a difference. Come 
On fire. Oh, it just saved it. So, this is... Or the, the currency. What? What's this one? A uh, single track. Easy enough. Front load a whole bunch so that you don't have to worry about doing damage back, I guess. Each one, I think, gives me 10 for killing it. Oh, there we go. Oh, that one's actually hitting him, too. Okay. Come on. Oh, some more of the... I think this is the in-game shop currency. Or the during-your-expedition currency. I think. I got one there, 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 there. I would like one here next. There. I don't think anything's getting through at this point. I got 82 monies. Uh, let's see here. So... I think I want another tower upgrade. Oh, this level again. Okay, you, you, uh, you. I would like another one there, yeah. I want one there. It's probably going to go through here. Need to make sure I'm saving money for the next round that tries to come through. All right, we're taking a little bit of damage, but I don't think it's too bad. Oh yeah, a little damage, but again, I think negligible. If we survive, all damage is negligible. Go. That's looking a-okay. I hope. Ah! Drat. Lost it on that level again. I think I misplaced something. Ah, oh, man. I'm not good at this. I'm not very good at this game. Uh. Oh. You're here again? Yes. Not if something doesn't work out right away. Good life advice right there. So what can I get? Oh, so I've got a different set of upgrades now. Um, extra armor, so I'm assuming less damage. I kind of like this. No. Yes. Because on that last one, if I would have just gotten money, I could have built one more tower that would have been enough to hold off. And I, I'm assuming these are the upgrades that I keep in between runs. I'm loving... I, I know I've said it before, but I am loving this art style. So I'm a circle here, but on the planet I'm a, I'm a, crystal, I'm a crystal shape that's fighting triangles and arrows. World of Nothingness, Grey Pit. Back at it again, I suppose. It'd be cool if I got permanent upgrades to my towers and not just the upgrades to my, what I'm assuming, the, the crystal, whatever the crystal is. Yeah, I lose all of my tower upgrades in between levels. Uh, it, I, yeah, that's fair. Again, roguelike element. You're not going to keep everything, but you can go back to like another shop to hopefully get new stuff for your next expedition. To hopefully go further. 
Hopefully you've learned a lesson. I won't learn a lesson because I'm always right. The game is just wrong for letting me lose. Um, oh, look at this. This is a different map. We haven't done this one before. So I want to build here first. I don't think two is enough to hold back the forces of evil. But I also know that I want to start dealing at least some damage over here and not have to rely on this choke point. Some more of this weird currency. Oh, I can't pick that one up. Oh, there it goes. So look at that. Because I did damage on the front and... Oh, these guys look tough. Hold on. So these guys, I think they're tankier units. Oh, man. Those guys are going to take some abuse. Oh, good lord. Ooh, but I just got a whole bunch of money. So let's... So I would rather deal damage... And when I play tower defense, I would rather deal damage consistently over the course of the, uh, of the enemy's adventure here than, like, front load a whole bunch of damage. Is this my reward? Yeah, that's my reward. So next is a tower upgrade. Uh, is there just one path? Yeah, there's just one path. So not a lot of imagination needs to go into this one. But I think my next one I'll place right here. No, I think I'm going to place it there. So these all appear to be, like, single level as of... Oh, nope. I was going to say single, uh... Like single wave. Or a lot of them appear to be, like, single wave. But I guess they're kind of starting to hit me with that multi-wave stuff. And I'll take my tower reward. Tower improvement? Cost minus five. Oh, the cost of the tower would be minus five. I'm going to take the firepower plus ten. You know, thinking about it here, if I get a tower upgrade and it now takes four shots instead of five, that's pretty significant. Ooh, let's do more of the... Whoa. This looks really cool. All right, where's stuff coming from first? Here. I'll do... Right. Yeah, that definitely... That looks like it's doing more. I would... Oh, wait, nope. Here. Here. And uh, now over here. But also back here. Okay. So I like having towers around here. I do like towers to do initial damage, but I guess on something like this where I can choke point, honestly, there's no method to the madness of how I place towers. I want kind of damage spread out all over here. Look at all this currency I got here. Is this a shop? It is! Damage modifier plus one, extra shards next level. Oh, my name is Topa. I was a member of the Ancient Expedition, and then I decided I didn't want to return. Since then, I've settled down to trade in all sorts of useful things. If you have enough crystal essence... Oh, that's essence. Take a look at my goods. I'll... I'll take that, and I'll take that. So I'll get extra shards in the next level, and then I get a couple more of this currency for when I die next. 
So where am I coming in at? What's this? Oh, nothing that I can click on. It's just part of the environment. I would like to do some damage to this stuff coming in over here. Oh, come on. There we go. Don't be shy. I think there's much else for building slots. One here, one there, a few there. These are yellow. Oh, they've got overshields. Well, that just became kind of complicated. I don't know if I'm going to live through this. So I don't like that when I place down a tower, it doesn't start shooting right away. Oh, um, tower upgrade. Rare. Tower improvement, minus three cost. Plus seven shield damage, though, but a fire rate. So not every enemy is going to have a shield, but a fire rate would be nice. But at the same time, being just things costing less. So it's 100%, so that would just take off three, which I don't think is significant enough. I'm going to take the fire rate, something that'll more universally... Oh, Chris, it's me, subpar. Subpar? Uh, how glad I am. I came here to test some theories, but I fell into a trap. Can you help me fight back? I guess... Uh, yeah, I guess there's fine. So is he helping me fight back too? Or is this just a... I wonder if anything's going to go for him. Oh, there are shielded enemies. So maybe shielded enemies are now a staple of the run? I wonder if they gain their shield back, too. Thank you. Alright, I took some damage there. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. I'm not sure what I could have honestly done different on that. Well, maybe the extra shield damage would have been worthwhile. Shield damage. I would like another tower upgrade, I think. So I'll throw something... Find out where this first batch is. I'll throw something here. Here. Something here, one here, and one here, for right now. I think this is where I die. Yep. Ah, so close. I'm actually having a tough time getting through this. I, I, wow. So, I think I'm positioning towers wrong. Researches? This is new. Oh, what's... Hi! Oh, it's the guy we rescued! Since you can successfully return, will you help me with my research? Research can give you permanent advantages in combat. Just select the research you want to focus on before submitting. Each stage can get you a reward. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's kill basic enemies. Let's go to the shop. Um, I've got six. 
Let's increase max health, I guess. Thanks a lot for saving. Oh, yeah, you're welcome. Without him, we would have gotten much slower. Research can help you a lot, so check it out from time to time. Okay. So I've got... 10% of shard corruption from enemies on damage. Increase health. All right, so we'll do one more round here and see how far we can get. It's going to put us here slowly, I guess. All right. Pull my head out of my ass. Let's do this. Let's go for the gold. This place again. My reaction exactly, buddy. Bring on the enemies. So, res oh, my research. So, kill basic enemies. So, I think the research right now is just to kill 100 of these things. Which should be pretty easy. Come on. So the enemy scaling in this game kind of confuses me. It doesn't seem so much that enemies... Well, we're definitely different varieties of enemies, but it just seems like they just shove more at you. Oh, I'm not keeping up with my building. I'm kind of getting lost in commentary land. Easy. Uh, let's see here. So, throw something here, throw one here, throw one here, throw one here? Sure. I'll throw one. I want to throw one here. Maybe I'm not giving that ranged upgrade enough credit. I might not be giving that ranged upgrade near the credit it deserves. Oh, wow. I need to spend more monies. It'd be cool if I could get, like, a slowing effect on the tower so enemies spend more time getting damaged around me. Huh. Kind of some odd pathing that they take. Perfect. Come on, get him. Oh, that was close. Again, not sure what all, how all I could have done differently there. Uh, so this looks just like a really long sort of path. I don't think anything can come from over here. But I'm going to hesitate to place down anymore until I can get that confirmation. I think I pretty much have that confirmation now. So, choke point here next. At least these guys have the courtesy to die in one hit. a lot of this green currency. I would take a shop next, I think. Given the opportunity, I think I would take a shop next. Shield guys. It looks like the shields do resist some essence of damage. All 
right, yeah, we got this in the bag. Shield guys worry me. I think I would take a shield if it was presented to me. Fire 8 cannon, shield damage 8, yes. Another upgrade, tower. Wow. Split path here, that's kind of cool. Else can I place one? Here, I panicked. I panicked. I panicked. Place there. Let's kill one more. Nice. Oh, they're fast and shielded. Isn't that bugger all? I think I misplaced again. Definitely misplaced again. Ooh. Ooh, that's tough. Well, let's see what the research revealed, and then we'll end this little one-shot here. I'm definitely going to keep playing this game in, like, my personal time. There seems to be a lot of meat on this thing for a demo. Uh, so maybe I need to focus on... Yeah, I definitely need to pay more attention to this thing. To this extra currency. Let's see what my research has got. So what did you get? Claim reward. Common enemies take 2% more damage. Guess that's okay. Look at all this different, look at all this different. Oh, you know, I'll take another stage of that. Yeah. So, um, so far I really like this game. It's definitely just challenging enough. Um, I'm going to be very curious, you know, where, how far can you get in this game? Uh, but unfortunately, that is all the time I have for right now. Um, again, if you guys want to see more of this demo, by all means, like the heck out of it, comment the heck out of it. If you want to see more of this game, I love this game and will be playing it on my own time. But if you'd like to see more of this on the channel, please, there's nothing that is stopping a one shot from becoming a full series. I kind of use the one shot to test the waters on stuff. But until then, guys, be seeing ya.